Hello sunshines, welcome back to the vlog. We are back from Boston. It's been a couple of days. We got back Friday night, today's Monday. And it honestly took me a few days to recover. I'm not even gonna lie. Not that it was even anything crazy, just chaos. You know what I mean? Just pure chaos. But it's a beautiful day. The sun is shining today. And today I'm finally going to put up the tree, the Christmas tree. I, I really wanted to get it up before we left for Boston, but there was just no time with Friendsgiving and travel and all of the things. But I figured today would be the perfect day because it was gloomy all weekend and just like filming was not the vibe. That's the only thing with winter is like filming is not a vibe because the sun goes down at 4 p.m. You guys have been watching the vlogs and you've seen that we've put up like some Christmas stuff, but we got a Christmas light for the outside. We got the trees, we got two trees and I'm motivated today. I am. I'm in it today. All right, so we have two trees. I'm gonna put the white tree up first in this little beautiful corner. Only thing is we have this table here from the Friendsgiving. So I'm thinking, like I kind of liked it there. It was like extra shelving, but I guess I'll put her back outside. And then I'm gonna wait for Mark to put up the green one, but he's practicing right now. But he was like, I wanna put up a tree. And I was like, okay. So if you hear music, it's cause he's practicing. felt so awkward but got the tree up I'm gonna put up some ornaments I got these super cute disco ball ornaments last year at a thrift store but they also sell them on Amazon and I love them so the theme for this one is like pink gold fun little trinkets so let's add these all right so we've got the ornaments up and I think I'm deciding that I want this to be pink I'm in my pink era right now clearly I'm wearing all pink and I don't know where the rest of my ornaments went. I feel like I'm missing some, but I think I'm gonna order some more pink ornaments and like trinkets for this tree. This is gonna be like the pink theme and the other one will be gold and white so that it has a full theme, but it feels like a little empty. So I wanna add some more disco balls and some more pink trinkets. I've decided that I'm going to go to the store really quick. I'm gonna go to Walmart, check out, see what they have for the Christmas vibes. I just like could not in my mind. I ordered a, I just like feel like I need so many more things where I'm like missing a box or something. I did decide I wanna do like a pink theme. So I'm just gonna see what they have for pink vibes. Cause I know I have plenty of stuff for the other tree, hopefully. We'll see. All right, it is the next day. We actually went to lunch with a friend today and then we stopped by TJ Maxx. So I wanna show you guys what I got from Walmart last night and then what I got from TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx was picked over. Like there was almost nothing there. I went for ornaments and there were no ornaments, but I did find a few other cute things. From Walmart, I found these cute little clip-on flowers. I got four of these and then they just have like a little clip. And then I also got, I got these super cute ornaments. I love that they're like sprinkles. I got this like dolphin one. These were like 98 cents, which is amazing. And then I had ordered these ornaments from Amazon and they just came in today and I put them up. Oh no, I was too excited to film it. I was like, I have to do this. And then I got some pink um, pompous grass. I actually ordered another one because I'm gonna need more for the full tree to like stick them in there. Um, oh, and then I also got this little Paris one, super, super cute. Didn't go too crazy at Walmart. There just wasn't like that many things. I feel like I'm just late to the game. From TJ Maxx, I got these cute little salt and pepper shakers. I have like pumpkin ones, so I feel like this is perfect for the holiday season. I should probably actually put salt and pepper in these because 
I usually just have them for decor, but these are so cute. They were like five bucks. So, so cute. I got this disco ball. Don't know where I'm gonna put it. I just love that it's gold. Like it's not silver, it's gold, which is so cool. And I was like, do I need this? I think, I think I need this. Also got some to-go coffee mugs. I love that it's pink and Christmas. Like, I don't know what happened, what came over me, but yesterday I was like, I want everything pink. Everything, as I'm wearing gray. But this I thought was so, so cute. Just like to-go little cups, especially in the morning when we're running at the door. I don't know if I ever showed you guys. I got this mug in, I got this mug from Anthropology. It was on sale. It's probably still on sale and I love it. It's like a cute little Christmas mug. I'm obsessed with mugs, like I have an issue. I have a problem. That's pretty much it. So later tonight we're gonna put up the second tree and hopefully they they did tell me at TJ Maxx that on Friday they're gonna be restocking a lot of their Christmas stuff. So I was like, okay, I think maybe I'll go back. I'll see what we have, put up the tree. And if I feel like we're missing stuff, then I can go look again and finish it off. I do love how the pink tree came out, the pink and white disco tree. That is gonna be the theme for this one. I love the disco balls so much. I would like to find a few more pink ornaments. So if I do, I will definitely add those. But for now, she's cute, she's filled. I'm okay with it, we're working with it. Next to the other random disco ball that I have. That makes no sense, but I just like to have them. we are back like we never left we're gonna put up the christmas tree finalmente we just had a wonderful dinner that my babe made delicioso babe how was it it was delicioso oh christmas lights so this company sent me this like christmas light thing that we can put on the outside and it'll show like figurines and things like that let me see where it, oh where's it shining Oh, look, babe. I kind of like it for in here. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that is so cool. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. Baby. <laughs> babe, are you, aren't you ready to put on the three? Amped. Babe, do you remember we put up the three in my parents' house? Many oh, yeah. years ago. Cheers. You were excited then. I'm excited. We can put up the tree. You <laughs> can occupy one of my hands. I'm going to do both. I'm going to do both. That's the top. Yes. Those are the 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 things for. Cause I'm your lady. What then? Talk to me. We gotta figure out which one's which. Oh, again? Oh, no, no, that's the bottom. Oh, again? <laughs> yeah, cause here's where the, the power thing is. I love how you left ornaments on here. You know. It'd be like that sometimes. What did these go to? Um, In between those things? I think so. Okay, we're gonna have to move this out. Okay. Cause this is gonna open up pretty good, you know? Yeah. <laughs> we just been not even close to being done. Okay, I'm ready. Uh, where's the power thing? Yeah. Spread out the leaves a little bit, make it look a little more full. I like this tree. Or not? Yeah, we, this was a good buy. It was like a decent. It was a decent price with all the bells and whistles. Just gonna go down. Oh, no. We're gonna wrap it around. Grab it for 
You think that's weird? It's just interesting. Like it's, I, it's fun. You know what I mean? But it's like, how did that start? You know? Well, I'm sure you can find the history on it, yeah, babe. You know I'm gonna do that. <laughs> sure, we can figure that out. Jesus. I love these ornaments. I got them last year at a little boutique here in Nashville. You're so cute, babe. Ornaments. <laughs> this is what we have for the tree so far. We still gotta get a star. We didn't have one last year and I didn't realize it until now. But this is how it's looking. You gonna turn off this light? Yeah. And Can you just keep it on the white lights? Uh, on for the tree. Yeah. Ooh. Ready? <gasps> no. Wait. Twinkling or do you want them just on? Just turn them on, keep them on. Oops, there you go. There we go. <gasps> I love it. What do you think, babe? Looks good. We did it. We did it. Look at all the the lights. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Good morning, sunshines. Today is November 29th. I'm so excited because I'm getting my hair done. Your girl needs it. I have gotten my hair done once before here in Nashville, but I've been able to finesse going back to El Paso with my hair girl who I've went for years. And I just, I got it done at the end of September. So the roots are rooting for sure. Like I'm basically brunette. And I think it's time. I just decided it was time. So I'm trying out this new girl. She's a friend of mine. Um, I actually met her because she has like a separate business where she sells like really cool vintage clothing and shoes with her husband. It's called Brother G. I've gotten so many cute things from them. I'll put like, you should check them out. I'll put their website down below. But I'm super excited. Let's hopefully, you know, it's really hard to find a hairdresser. I feel like there's a trust that has to go into this. And so I am scared. But I'm also excited and I'm just like, okay, it's almost December, it's almost the new year, like I'm feeling like all the feels, you know what I mean? Like I'm feeling motivated, refresh, reset, and I think getting my hair done will be awesome. So I already went to, I went to the gym this morning, I'm gonna make a protein shake, makeup is done, I'm gonna get dressed. So excited! All right, this is the fit for today. Going super comfy, wearing these like loose Levi jeans that I honestly wear so much because they're loose and they're a vibe, and then wearing this oversized jacket from Cider. Yes, they actually have really, really cute stuff. And then just like a long sleeve and a hat because my hair is on day four of not being washed. And I feel like I need to get more into hats and more taking advantage into different styles of hats because I have tons of like wide brim, but sometimes I feel like that's not the vibe, you know what I mean? So, all right, and of course, some comfy Uggs. Maybe this will be the cover. Friday, December 1st. 1st of December, babe. 
You know what that means? Christmas is 25, four days away. 24 days. 24 days only. Oh my gosh, that's so true. Where did the year go? Where did the year go? We're heading downtown right now because I have an audition with Song Suffragettes at the listening room while well, they moved it. Technically, it's gonna be a Nash Fox, but I'm gonna sing a couple songs. I hope they like me. They will. I'm excited. It's a rainy, gloomy day today, but we're not gonna let that take us down, are we, babe? Nah. Nah. Nah, son. I am sweating. Sweating. Are you sweating? I'm sweating. No, no. Babe, I'm, I'm hot. Well, look at you. <laughs> we'll see, babe. It's the winter time. <laughs> so you turn on the AC. <laughs> I'm pretty warm. Warm. morning sunshines. Today is Saturday, December 2nd. Insane, it's December. I feel like I left you guys high and dry yesterday with like what we were doing and going to. So yesterday we had an audition for Song Suffragettes, which is an like all female writers round show here in Nashville. And I don't know. so yes, we had the audition for Song Suffragettes. They reached out to me and it went really well. So I'm booked for a show on December 18th, which I'm so excited about. And it's actually crazy because I literally submitted to, you know, like perform like online about a year ago. Like a year ago, I submitted myself to like a bunch of different things, um, you know, like sent in my music, all my socials, all of that. And like literally never heard back from anyone. And then all of a sudden, I mean, within the past few months of like getting reached out to and like getting booked to do shows, um, not because they saw my application, but because they like found me online or something, which is insane, but it's kind of how it works, I guess. And then honestly, I just spent the rest of the day organizing my closet, which I meant to vlog, but I'm also doing Vlogmas on TikTok. I usually do it here on YouTube, but I'm gonna try it on TikTok. If you guys think I should do it on YouTube as well, let me know in the comments. If not, just go check out my YouTube. I mean, if not, I'll be doing it for sure on TikTok. It's already December 2nd, so if I was gonna do Vlogmas here, I would have started that, but that's fine. Did it last year here on YouTube. I think I did it the year before as well um, on my other channel, like on my music channel, but I wanted to try it on TikTok to see, you know, the vibe. And it's kind of a little bit easier to like edit and get it up super quick, but you know, but I'm definitely gonna still be uploading here on YouTube. I just, yeah. I only have like 45 minutes at the gym. I'm probably just gonna walk and stretch and maybe do some abs because we're performing today at Hampton Social, super last minute, and Mark's still asleep. He played really light last night, so let's get in there. And my fat printer's kicking in. Banana? Yeah, it's biodegradable. In fact, it's very good for the soil. I'm so sorry. Just get it on the soil. Don't get it on the street, though. Ah. Oh my God, babe. Sorry. I didn't mean. I was like, it's because I was like looking at what you were doing. Yeah. So I had to stop saying it. It's not up on me. Pretty much, it doesn't look as bright. No, not at all. Okay, we are back home. That came home to a little ah, came home to a little package oh God. Oh God, from TikTok shop. Little little coffee situation. Let's see. The lighting is better this way, but I don't have anything to put it. The camera on. Let's see. Brunch was delicious. Okay, I think I should do this over here. Come, babe. I, was gonna, all right. I want you to see this. There we go. All right, so we got a little coffee situation going on. What's going on? What, babe? 
Should I open it? Yeah. Damn. Wow. This is hardcore. So this is for like camping or like if is you're going, it? yeah. What? So I'm going to take it this week when we go to Gatlinburg. Nifty little case. Wow. That's pretty cool. That's pretty awesome. What the? Oh, cool. So here's a container. Yeah. Oh look, it tells you how many ounces of, of coffee. Wow, that is so cool. Well, that, that, that would be four, you know what I mean? Yeah. Look, babe, you grind the coffee in here. Oh, okay. So this is like an espresso thing. Yeah. Oh, Isn't okay, that dope? so you put the water in here. I'm gonna have to figure this out. I'm gonna be like out in the woods, making a little coffee. A little cafecito. Wow. What the? Measuring stuff. Oh, that's to clean your grinder. Oh. Oh. That just. I'll have to go through these, in, through, through these instructions. How, how thin you want it, yeah. or fine? Yeah, that's the right word, fine. Put the coffee in there. See the grinders? Yeah. Nice. Dope. TikTok shop. TikTok shop. TikTok shop. I'll link it down below. I need to figure out how to use it. We'll figure that out. Breathe. Oh, huh. Get up, get up, get up. Breathe, babe. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna put this leg out. <laughs> all right, all right. Now, do, now move your body in this position so it's not supposed to. Breathe. Spread your arms out. Look to that way. Breathe. Breathe. Don't hold in your breath. Stop blowing on me. Fuck these blowing air on like directly at my face. <laughs> I look at you, you're <laughs> Do that other side again. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna do a handstand. On me? No, on the floor. But I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> I know, around you. No. Yeah. Do you, okay, think about this. Think about the clearance between your head and the ground. And then think about the clearance you have from here to here. <laughs> you don't get it, baby. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Can I just stretch by myself? <laughs> Fine, babe. I was trying to help you. No, you did help me though. Especially on like the crazy ones. 